for the homeowners on both the east and west side upset, unhappy, and disappointed with the city's garbage ticketing policy. News 5 found the city issued more than 4,400 fines, totaling thousands of dollars to homeowners in just 10 months but not following curbside trash guidelines. Some residents tell our Five on Your Side investigator Joe Paganakis the city needs to provide more warnings and better instructions before they get slammed with a fine. Well, the 10 blocks along West 47th Street and West 48th have been hit hard by city trash violations. More than three dozen tickets issued here in less than a year. Some of the violations that went unpaid total more than $160. Well, it was disappointing because we were doing our cleaning. We were trying to get better. Eva Velasquez says she was stunned when she was issued a $100 initial fine for not following these city guidelines when putting her trash and recyclables on the curb. You no, know, we never got any warnings, any explanations before. No, it was a little confusing for us. Eva, like many of the Cleveland residents we talked to, realized there are violators who too often leave a mess on their tree lawn on trash pickup day. But residents say there should be more warnings issued and the $100 to $350 fines are too heavy for lower income homeowners. In this neighborhood, we don't have no $125 to $325 to pay for no recyclable and not recyclable can. Residents like Sheila Moore believe the city should provide even more homeowner education instead of issuing an estimated 700,000 in tickets in a 10 month period between August 2018 and May 2019. Cleveland Councilman Tony Brancatelli agrees. We need to continue to reach out to residents and say, continue to communicate. So not only in our newsletter, we should do some more direct mailers. Still, Brancatelli maintains the growing number of tickets issued are unfortunately needed to help curb an increase in trash tribulations and get homeowners to recycle the right way. We have to fix that bad behavior and the dumping and environmental hazards that we've seen over the past few years, um, we have to stop that. And Brancatelli says residents can appeal trash tickets they believe are unfair. Appeals are run through the Board of Building Standards. The fee is just $15. Reporting here in Cleveland, I'm Five on Your Side investigator Joe Paganakis.